Hello, my name is Jennifer, and welcome to part 25 of House 4 of the Drifter Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And we're just about to age up Emmeline to a child. So I need to have Dominique and not do that. Go into her phone. I still do that every now and again. And plan a social event. And we're going to try and plan a dinner party because that is what she needs for her food aspiration to earn a silver on a dinner party. Poor little Ernie is sad because he had a potty accident when we were potty training him, which didn't take very long probably because he just used his diaper. So we'll see whether we need to change his diaper. I expect we probably will. So we're going to make it a, a, a gold event because we're hoping to get a gold on it. We actually need to get a silver for our aspiration. We're going to invite some party, some family members over to the party and I'll be back once the party is started. Okay, so we are good to go now. We need to make a garden salad and we do actually have a vegetarian because we invited her grandfather and he's a vegetarian so garden salad will be perfect. So we're going to cook a <laughs> cook a garden salad and then we'll call everybody to meal. I'm not going to use fresh ingredients because I don't know what quality they are. And I find that if they're not better than normal quality produce that you use, then sometimes the food only turns out normal. So she she was all in her winter clothes from selling everything. I didn't invite every family member because it turns out she doesn't actually know everybody in the family. But I did invite Bridget, which she's not actually friends with her. So she was the one who is her half aunt, I guess. Um, but I was thinking the, of the, you know, making friends with her and moving her possibly into the house. So finish your cake, finish your salad, I should say. And then we will call to meal and I guess, oh, good boy. Thank you, Lucas. I don't know what it is you're teaching or what, whether it's which type of flashcards needs. Good. Any teaching is good and appreciated. Greatly appreciated, I have to say. So you're going to finish that and we're going to um, call to meal because we need to do that to get our our silver or our gold, actually. And uh, She seems to be a little flirty. I don't know that we actually made enough food, so we probably should make something else because <laughs> there's a lot of people and we don't have very much food. So we're going to try and make a some pasta primavera is what we will do. There you go. And we don't really care about the rest of the goals because she has a pristine reputation. And once you get to a great reputation, then you're good to go. So we're not going to make any coffee or anything like that. Are you hungry? I guess you can eat. But you have some, some guests who are going hungry. And we need to age up little Emmeline. Okay, good. You're going to cook. So we're going to get some more food. I'm going to take that, thank you, and put it in the garbage. Make us 40 simoleons. Make some of our money back from the cost of this party. But you also make money back from the gifts that you get. How are your needs, little one? You're hungry. You're taking a bath. You're tired. What we're going to do is we are going to uh, parenting help her give her another second wind when we're finished with this and then we're going to go and age her up looks like Dominique's a little tired too I could have made him a I made Lucas a guest instead of a host but I guess I could have you know I don't know whether he would have done much socializing anyway so now I'm gonna go grab the cake out of the fridge because we made that winter cake it is winter and we are going to come and we are going to help blow out candles Emmeline. There we go. And we'll see what she looks like as a child, though that's still not really much indication of how she'll look as. Oh, <laughs> you're playing. Are you, who are you playing with? Because it looked like you were like playing with somebody. <laughs> but no one was in your arms. Okay, so now I need to get set up. Abraham, you're kind of in the way. But maybe we can manage this. Gonna get a picture at least already. That's not really the best shot. There we go. Another picture and then hit play. Yay! And she got it on the first go. 
And now we're going to have her age up and see what she looks like. So she is going to, I can't change her aspiration because I can't control her. So I'm going to put her on the mental aspiration because that is one that I have found. I've had a lot of luck influencing when I can't play the sim, but she is going to be creative because that'll be good in her painting career when she gets older. <laughs> and there we go. And people have already come and taken the cake. So there we go. That's what she looks like as a child. I'll have to give her a makeover and maybe while I'm doing it, I might give our little Ernie a makeover or give him new clothes. Give him a few more different clothes than what he currently has. So we have our heir as a child now. Now she is sad from low energy. Speaking of sad from low energy, it's time for a new bit of a little makeover for the bedroom. We'll let her keep her current what she has in terms of the wallpaper. She can go... I don't know why that didn't work. Let's try that again. So I'll just do a quick renovation of this house, this room for her, and I'll just show it in fast moment, fast sped up, I should say, and I'll be back when it's over. <laughs> So I didn't do that much with the makeover because I really didn't want to spend a lot of money, <laughs> to say the least. So Dominique, can you actually, can she have another second wind or does she need to, um, parenting, help with needs, give a second wind. And we can actually have her claim the bed. Can't do anything else to control her. Well, we can have her age up when it comes time for her to age up to the next stage. And then we're going to have... You're going to come in here and you're going to put to bed Emmeline. There you go. And we can read the frogs again. <laughs> so there we have our little um, Emmeline as a... I'll probably change her hair. But maybe she could have a little princess hair maybe she likes that since I did do pink color for her generally but yeah I didn't get a lot for her room I got her a good bad and I got her some things that she may use for skill building but I didn't get any decor I didn't get her a dresser actually this is supposed to be a closet here so this wouldn't actually even fit where I put it if I did put that there but for now we don't have any of that because I would like her to make a little bit more money so luckily he's looking after himself how is little Ernie He's sad. You know what? We're, he needs to eat a bit more. Where is he? Where is our little littlest one? There he is. So we are going to grab a serving for Ernie. Because you need to eat, sweetheart. Actually, Dominique needs to like look after her own needs. But, you know, we'll worry about that. <laughs> oh. Is he? Did you give that to him? So why don't you come over here and use that because you need to and we'll put the food in the fridge because I find Sims visiting come and get food out of the fridge anyway so we don't really need to do anything about having it out on the counter for them. And we're not really doing very much with the party. I guess they're all hanging around. We could just end the party. She is actually on the right aspiration for that, so that's good. It is actually getting pretty late, but we don't need to. It ended on its own. So she needs to create three types of excellent food if we were to like, continue this, but we'll... You know, she's not working on anything else right now. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put her back over on her family aspiration. So she needs to help a child with homework three times and have a child max. So the only thing she can really work on here is the homework with three times right now. And the super parent, I'm going to leave her there because she needs to discipline her child. So she has one. Okay, you didn't eat very much, Ernie. What's going on? You're still not full. And what are you doing sleeping? I didn't tell you to go to bed. 
So we're going to come over here and we're going to give him a second wind because he needs it. He is exhausted, poor little thing. And we're going to come over here and we're going to potty train Ernie. And then we are going to read him to sleep. And then finally, then you can actually have something from your inventory. I was just thought, well, I wasn't purposely going in to uh, check the frogs. I figured since I was here, I would check it anyways. Okay, she's so tired. I think I'm going to have her nap because I want her, I would... If possible, I'd like her to sell stuff before. Okay. I don't know. I don't know why they leave the room and then come back to go do the reading in the bed. Which gets worse and worse the bigger the house is because then they go so far. Okay, that's not your bed. This is your bed. Why is that not claimed as your bed? I don't understand that. I would have thought I, but you know, sometimes things get messed up. So you're having a nap. And once you're finished napping... This time I was purposely looking for those frogs. You're going to come actually here and clean that. Oh, it's too late anyways. Just go to sleep. <laughs> just just have another bite of something to eat. And another bite to eat. And then just go to sleep. I just wanted that potty ready for us to use when we needed it for little. And is this something we can't paint? This is someone else painted there. So we're going to have to get rid of it. So I'm just going to gradually clean up some of this food. Put that in the fridge. And so we'll obviously make, you know, 40 simoleons per plate that I stick in there. But I'll be back when they wake up. Evelyn woke up first. She was hungry. So she ate and she did the dishes. So I'm going to have Dominique encourage her for doing the dishes. I woke Dominique up. I figured I didn't even look at how much she'd slept. She's still kind of tired. Oh, no. We're going to have some embarrassment. No, no. But I think she doesn't. She doesn't get embarrassed. <laughs> so much for that. <laughs> well, you may as well go back to sleep while she's having her bath. <laughs> oh, well. She's embarrassed, though. But luckily, children and teens cannot die from embarrassment. <laughs> so it's okay. Check in on Ernie's needs. He's uh, hungry because he never ate his food when he went to bed last night. He's still tired because he was exhausted when he went to bed last night. So exhausted, and Lucas is going to work today. <sighs> he seems to work a lot, I have to say. And I'm going to go into build mode because I want to get rid of this painting because it's not completed. Oh, we'll just put it, I'm sure it's not completed. Oh, we can sell it for 183. <laughs> Sometimes I do find that that happens. And we got some gifts in our inventory, and we're going to sell them. I'm going to sell the pot rack. I just finally spent a lot of time looking at it. And for the next party, maybe we'll buy a tea maker. But I just see something is broken there. Um, so we better go fix that. <laughs> if we're on the right sim. You should come repair that. It is prank day though. So I might actually have a club gathering. We're going to have her come over here. And invite to our club. Because we have a club. So we're going to invite her to the club. And when we go over to Oasis Springs Park, which is a nice way to get out of the cold winter, then we can um, maybe change add to the club activities. Just for right now, we can add. We're going to get rid of the Be Romantic. Because now that we have others in the group, it doesn't really feel right. It was all right when it was just the two of them. So we're going to go under social and say be mischievous. Because then she might possibly get her prank day things. We can't start the gathering here, but we can start it on the lot. And unfortunately, poor Lucas isn't going to be here for it. Unless we go to the park when he gets home, perhaps we may end up doing that. Okay, I think you've slept enough. You have slept enough, my dear. You need to make some food is what you need to do. Because we're not allowed to have a club gathering on your home lot. But you can have it off the lot. So that's a good thing. And I do wonder if enough time has passed. It has indeed. There is enough time. So you're going to repair that. You may as well... Um, can we encourage her to do anything? Parenting? Influence to? Skill building? We're not going to bother asking her to go outside. But we could ask her to draw on the activity table. More choices. Set table. Take out trash. Sleep. Play. Yeah, I don't know that we really care. She can just do her own thing right now. So you're going to, um, if I can get over here. Well, what are we going to do? Scavenge for parts. 
And then we can come over here. <laughs> we can do our... We have to do the prank things too, actually. She loves this from being a geek. So, let's see. No, we just did that. And she leveled up in her movement skill. So we are going to... I guess we could do something mischievous. We can... Uh, I don't know. What I was going to do, forget the mischievous, I was going to come over here and do parenting influence to mop puddles. That will help her responsibility and get the place clean. And then we're going to come down here and we are going to harvest... these dragon fruits and then we're going to sell everything. I think we have enough in our inventory for now. No, we're not going. Thank you. We're going to ignore the artist. Actually, we're going to collect these mushrooms. Harvest the mushrooms and then we are going to super sell the other things. And then we're going to come over here and super sell. Cause that, or just sell. I guess we'll sell all. That'll take her outside. But whatever. Because <laughs> by, by doing the dragon fruit, they were right in the middle. So then it didn't help. Oh no, there's a... Oh, it's from a freezing storm. So she's doing that, unfortunately. And she's back to dancing. We may as well have... There we go. Oh no, Ernie is hungry. Let me pause this. Forget this. Forget this. Forget this. Forget all this. You're going to come over here. You need to feed Ernie. Come over here and you're going to give food from inventory. We're going to give him some basil. And we're going to go over here and give food from inventory. We don't want to lose Ernie. That would be awful. We'll give him some sage. Not really ideal, but I'm rushing. <laughs> I'm rushing. That really matters. Time stops when you're doing this. Come over here. Run, 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 run. Get over here quickly. You need to give him some food. He's hungry. Poor boy. Let's see. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So, so hungry. We need to give him some more fruits and vegetables. Get food from inventory. Do we have like an apple? I know you have an apple. Can we find an apple? We'll give you a grape. Would you like a grape? Yeah. We don't, we can't have you be so hungry. You're still really, really hungry. Look at that. You're still very hungry. This is not the like angry red. It's more an orange red. Not as bad. We're going to try again. Oh, it was right there. <laughs> Always do that. <laughs> Give food from inventory. Can I get that apple? Is there an apple? There's an apple. Then we're going to potty train him. You're going to potty train him, and now he should be better shape. He's still hungry, but not so bad. Not so bad that we can, like, not leave him to, like, get his potty training, and then we can pick up some food. And who's made this? Oh, wrong. It's wrong, Sim. <laughs> we'll resume that camper's stew. After he's potty trained. I grab some food. I put it on the table there, so hopefully he'll go get it on his own. She's hungry too, actually. Hopefully he'll go grab it. If he doesn't, we'll have to, like, influence him. But I find that when I try and do that, sometimes they get... Um... Can you go eat, Ernie? You're hungry, are you not? That if I try and grab the food, then sometimes they... They go grab it on their own, and then there's, like, some confusion if I try and give them food. We'll put that. He doesn't, I don't know. He doesn't seem to be eating it. How hungry are you? You're a little bit hungry. But probably not so hungry that you can't wait for the dinner that's being made. So it looks like we might be going to the park after all, all together. So there we go. So you're going to eat. So why don't we put this here and why don't we uh, call to meal. Are you hungry, Emmeline? You're hungry too, so that will help. It will be nice if you finish this painting. This might interfere with you finishing the painting, in which case we'll just take it off of the table. 
I don't know if you'll ever resume it on your own. Did you actually finish it? Because that would be good because then we can put some, some crafts up in your room and decorate your room with the Christmas crafts. I guess it'll be winter, winter fast soon. That would be good. She's gonna, but I think we're not going to make it to prank day in this part. Oh, she seems to have gotten some things for prank day. So maybe we should just, while we're, before we go to the park, maybe we'll try going to the park, but maybe oh, we can become best friends. We're not going to do that. I think we're, I'm guessing we're best friends with our husband. So there's not really any point. So I need to actually go under mischievous. I wonder what she did. <laughs> um, we can start a preposterous warrant rumor. When does he... Oh, look, he needs to have a shower. Hopefully he actually runs inside because he's not very good at doing that. And he... <laughs> it's going to be a struggle to get him to level 6 of the painting skill to level up his painting. Because he works so much. My goodness, he works five days a week. I like the painting career later because they don't work very much, but he works a lot right now, I have to say. Like, he works a lot of days and 9 to 5. But he gets home soon enough. Actually, speaking of home soon... Speaking of time... It's time for us to breed these frogs. There we go. And we may as well sell them. Well, we're th while I'm thinking about it, we will sell those frogs. Put those in our inventory. And we still don't quite have 35,000 simoleons, unfortunately. Are you going to clean up or is Patchy going to do the cleaning? Patchy, could you clean up the, um, the potties? That would be really, really helpful. It looks like she needs to have a shower too. So why doesn't she take a shower? And she's got, she's, well, why don't we do some, we are going to come over here and friendly. We're going to, oh, she's having, right. Cause I told her to have a shower. Not friendly. We're going to go under mischief and we will instill with false confidence. And there he is. He is home and we got 35,000 simoleons so we can come here and um we'll go on the fortune aspiration get that done yay so now she i don't know that she'll complete it completely but at least she's gotten somewhere with it we have a home worth fifty thousand. we own nine pieces of art i guess we need a little bit more but you know i'm sure we'll get there i don't think we'll complete the mansion bear and aspiration but at least we'll at least we have a home worth fifty thousand. that may be one of the goals for this challenge i'll have to double check with the rules because they do vary house by house, what the house is supposed to be worth. But I don't think it's supposed to be worth more than that. But uh, I was putting her back onto the super parent aspiration because I wanted to come in here and uh, parenting, encourage her doing the dishes so that we can get that last one there and get her a few more points. And we actually have enough. Oh my goodness, we got more than a few more points. That's a lot. Um, no, Dad, we're married. I wish we wouldn't get calls like that when we're married. Thank you very much. He needs to have a shower. We have a shower over there. You can go over there. I had seen the teach responsibility come up, so I was kind of wanting to do that. But, you know, we'll do it another time. Where Did Patchy? Oh, Patchy's back. Okay. But I think we're going to leave this part here. In the next part, we'll probably fingers crossed take them to the park so they can finish the prank day but hopefully lucas will have a shower on his own before we go out i'll give him a little bit of time to do that if he doesn't get it done then i'm gonna have to ignore that and take him as he is but that's gonna be it for this part thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time bye this has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge, let's plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.